Hello friends, welcome to episode 20. In this video, we are going to see how you can merge cases in Dynamics 365. Some important points to note regarding the merge cases functionality in Dynamics 365. So when you merge two cases, all the open activities are combined under one case and the remaining cases are canceled. So you actually need to select one case, which, we, which will be the primary case where all the cases will be merged into. And it is possible to merge up to 10 cases at a time and not more than that. And the merge case functionality also works with parent child cases as well. Okay, so there might be a situation where multiple cases are related to the same issue. So in such cases, instead of handling them individually, you can also merge those cases and then provide a solution uh, to the customer. So in this scenario, we have uh, some cases like that. Now over here at the top two rows, you can see that these are the two cases. One came in via email and another via phone call. And this is related to the same customer. They are using the business central product and they are facing some issues um, while doing the setup. So um, there was a case by email. Um, which said, okay, they have issues with the general ledger setup and somebody also called as well uh, and the case was registered in the system saying that, or they are facing some issues with the accounting setup. So it essentially relates to the same issue. That's what uh, the Tech Quantum support team decided. And they also suggested to merge these two cases so that, you know, a proper solution can be provided or a same solution can be provided for these two cases. Now, the thing is that if we go to one of the cases over here, and by the way, if you want to know how to create a case or how the case is created from an email um, you should refer to some of my previous videos like um, episode 15 uh, episode uh, 17 and 18 so those will be the three episodes uh, you can have a look and you can have much more in-depth um, information about how to handle the cases and how the cases are created by activity anyways so this case which came in via the phone call also you know our support consultant has actually worked on that and has registered some activities with it and these activities as you can see are open activities so uh, the reason why we have specified over here is that when we merge these two cases uh, you should be able to see that the activities are also merged even though they are open activities so let's just go back to the cases once again and to merge these two cases um, i will select these cases one by one and then as you can see over here on the ribbon the merge cases icon now appears so these two cases are ready to be merged so what I can do is I can click on merge cases over here now over here you need to select among these cases there may be you know many more cases that you're merging so you have to select one case into which all the other cases will be merged and this activity cannot be undone once you have done that so it's important that you uh, make sure that that's the case in which you want to merge everything. So I want to select this case and all the activities from this case will be merged into it and as well as this case by itself will be merged to it. And once this is merged, the other cases will be uh, in cancelled state. So let's just go ahead and click on merge. And now over here, you can see a message uh, that one case merged successfully into general ledger setup issue. A business central that's the title of the case so click on ok now if you check the status of this case it is now cancelled and this case where everything is merged is in active state so if i open this case right now over here you will notice that all the activities uh, which were there in the other case are now merged into this case and are in the open state and if you go to case relationships over here, you will now see that the merged cases are available in this particular tab and they also uh, specify the status of those cases. So as a history, you can, you know, always go back and see what cases were merged. And um, but right now, if you want to provide solution, you just need to provide solution on this case and carry out the business process over here till you resolve the case. I hope you understood the concept. So why don't you go ahead and try it out for yourself?